I have been working on a Pokemon village, and here's a map of the overhead. Got a daycare right here, and an inn, and we got a Poke Center and a Pokemart. And right over here is a park. Let's go take a tour. My beautifully crafted road. My ankles. <laughs> so we enter here, you get a nice view. Poke Center right there, coming from the woods. And we can go left and go up towards the Poke Center, Poke Mart, and eventually what I'm going to have over there. I'm still kind of planning out the city city plan, so to speak. And go down here. We get met by a stone brick wall. <laughs> Parking lot for the daycare. I still need to make some signs. And from the parking lot, you can look over and you can see inside. Got some reaps being looked after right now. <laughs> Little swimming area and the uh, jungle gym. I still need to make the interior for this place. We gotta, we'd have a uh, the daycare people there, and you'd have your in rooms up here, which I still need to do interior, so I won't bother showing that off. And out here, use a balcony so you can look at a Pokemon it's being taken care of at the daycare. And you enter the daycare by going down this way, and here's where your Pokemon will be free to play. However, this daycare does have a darker secret. What is the daycare hiding? Dramatic pause. What's up, internet, and welcome to Minecraft. And behind these doors, an illegal underground Pokemon battling arena. People stand there, and the Pokemon there. You know, you know how that battling works. And down that way I'm gonna have like a, a lab or something in the mountains. Maybe Team Rocket or something. Something cool. And we go right. Probably have houses and stuff in through this area. We go down this road and we see a park. I suddenly they had benches and maybe some more trees. Right there we have sewage uh, plumbing system, pu pushing water out into the river. I put these glowstone there so mobs won't spawn. There's another view of the bridge from the park. And here you get a lovely view of the Poke Center and the Poke Mart. Parking lots on either side. Cars do exist. Now we go into the Poke Pokemon Center. You'd have your thing where you can choose your party from the game. I like the effect of using paintings and stuff to beat computers. 
Nurse Joy's little computer thing. Where you'd have your Pokeballs being stored while your Pokemon are being healed. Huh, these, these paintings disappeared. There were paintings on here. these paintings. These would be like your video call and your uh, other ATMs and stuff that you need and, and all that fun stuff. Upstairs you'd have, in the games you'd have your, you know, trading, battling, and other stuff that you'd get. I figured kiosks or something. And behind the stairway down here would be care centers. Pokemon that aren't in balls. You put there. Well, that's more or less it, besides the skylights for the Pokemon Center. Okay. Could be better, but I'm not the best builder. <laughs> Parking lot for the Poke stuff. Pokemart. Trying to make a nice illuminated sign. I have to remodel that somehow a little bit. Just trying to figure it out and make it look good. Got some potions and special items behind the behind the counter. And where you'd get your shopping done. Pretty simple. Easy. Easy to understand. And I figured I'd have the stadium over this way somewhere. Good little tour of my Pokemon world so far. And I was going to expand the road down this way a little bit more, maybe put some more stuff down here. Maybe have a gym down here somewhere. Or maybe I'd put the gym over here, in this corner. I don't want the stadium, probably over here. And that's my uh, Pokemon world so far. It's growing, and I'll be doing ups um, updates uh, every now and then. <coughs> but for now, that'll be it.